All right, a real quick look at the Veravon mini armor cage. I think that's what they call it. Uh, so the cage is actually pretty cool. It's got like this weird contour design. Um, and at first you look at it, it doesn't make sense. It doesn't look like the other cages out there, but um, what they're doing is they're clearing all access to the camera body. Um, so you'll see this little shape out here and that's so you have access to your hot shoes still. And then it's uh, pushed out this way and you still have access to all your HDMI and microphone inputs. Uh, so the cage is actually designed really well. Um, we were running around with it today and uh, it actually just felt really comfortable. It just felt more like part of the camera rather than just this like beastly cage. So on, on this side here, they give you some 15 millimeter uh, rods, these little stubs. And uh, what we've done is we've added a, a Wanlin um, little target shooter shoulder support thing here so that um, when we go handheld, uh, we have an extra point of contact here. And then as you can see, we've got the Veravon uh, viewfinder on here. So this is the one I showed a long time ago. And um, this mates with the quick release that's already built into the cage. So you just loosen this up and then the whole unit slides out um, and then slides back in and you just lock it up right here. So uh, it's really nice. Um, this little setup right here is actually pretty lightweight, uh, fairly comfortable. Um, you know, and the viewfinder is one point of contact, then you have another point of contact here, so uh, pretty stable. Demo? <laughs> so there you go. Stability. So it's easy to get that off of, uh, say, a tripod, move it over to, um, you know, your monopod and just shoot with a monopod or just go handheld. That's it. Quick look at the uh, Vervon cage.